Hi everyone, it's Anastasia Kaya. Uh, today I want to show you how you can create a background for your layout. Uh, this is a 12 by 12 cardstock using some art girl stamps. I'll be using this uh, Bunny Girl Gwen, be using the little heart and also a stamp from this Happy Day stamp set. Uh, the ink I'll be using today is from uh, New Arts. It's Stonewash and Field Green. So let's get started. So I um, think I'm going to start by using the uh, Stonewash ink, the blue one. So I have a certain kind of a layout in mind. I'm hoping to focus my my photo and the, all the layering somewhere around here. So this is the part where I won't be stamping as much but no rules anyway. So I'm just stamping these hearts kinda randomly-ish. And I am not too bothered about them being perfectly stamped because I will be adding mists and gesso and some other fun stuff to the whole thing. Okay, so let's wipe this thing off with a baby wipe. And let's try the... Uh, green on the field greens. And I'm just stamping wherever. I guess I'm kind of leading from down here and up to this oops point. So it has kind of a flow to it, but not too specific, really. Mainly about having fun. And now I'm going to be using these arrows from the uh, Happy Day collection. And I'm going to use the green one. And I am going to stamp off. So I want it to be a bit lighter. So I'm just going to stamp once and then get the lighter version on my layout. You see, it's not perfect here, but I personally am not bothered about that. I just want a bit of hint. Hint of green. Maybe a bit here. I think I'll just add one more to this cluster. Oh, oh, where, where, where? Let's do it like that. Okay. Okay, so now I'm ready to finish off my layout. I Cut three different pieces of six by six papers. Uh, these are from Pebbles from the uh, Walnut Grove collection and Sunny Side. Then I also grabbed a doily, the photo, and a bit of mist. I've got Terry Angel Forest Green and Lindy's Buccaneer Bay Blue. I think that's how you pronounce it. And then, of course, I've got my gesso as well. So let's start with the uh, so just put a little bit of piece there and I use this bus cart from De Borg comes in handy and I can't really use it here <laughs> I'm just going to apply it here and there. 
no water, just bits of pieces here and there. Just to add a bit of texture, really. Adding some splatters of mist. I'm going to start with the uh, Ted Angels one, Forest Green. Using the uh, Lindy's stamp game one, and I'm going to be splattering that as well. I'll get that to dry. So now I'm going to be layering these things together and doing a bit of embellishing and whatnot and I'll be speeding this up uh, as well
So this is one way of using your somewhat girl steps to create your own background for your layouts and you use basically whatever stamp you like just your favorites will always make you the happiest and I stamp these and not thinking too much of it to be perfectly stamped and apply gesso on top some misting splatters and some animal dots here and then you have these ones at the uh, bottom so these create kind of a great flow from one corner to the other uh, this is quite a fairly simple layout bit of tiny bit of layering some ink splatters and the title and that's it so thanks for joining